this, this will be quick, short, and easy, I, I promise. But I can remember like 10 plus years ago at a Starbucks one night, Allie was like, I think Steve and my mom should date. And well, at the time, I don't think either of you guys were interested in dating. It wasn't that y'all weren't friends. And so, but so I guess we could give Allie credit because she had all this foresight all these years ago, right? Yes. But anyway, it's later fall. Oh, I didn't want to say that. But we are gathered here today in the presence of God to unite Steve and Vicki in marriage. The Bible teaches that the man will leave his father and mother and unite with his wife, and the two will become one flesh and be companions for life. Let's go ahead and pray real quick. Father, I just thank you for this day. I thank you for the opportunity to be here together with friends and family. Uh, celebrating this day and we just pray that over these next few minutes God that you bless everything that happens and that we bring glory to you in Jesus name amen okay well uh, you both know this but uh, Steve and Vicki your love must be unconditional not only must it be unconditional but it must be selfless and today Steve your your all your victories and all your losses were just yours and Vicki before today all your losses and all your victories were just yours but now you guys win together you lose together you share in victories and losses but you do it together with God in the center of everything you do and I know you both know that because I've known both of you for a really long time but it's good to remind ourselves Okay. But the best definition uh, of love comes from 1 Corinthians 13, starting in verse 4. It says, love is patient, love is kind, it does not envy, it does not boast, it is not proud, it is not rude, it is not self-seeking or easily angered. It keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in evil, but rejoices in truth. It always protects, it always trusts, it always hopes, always perseveres, and love never fails. Okay, so now I'm going to have you face each other, and repeat after me, Steve, you start. I, Steve, take you, Vicki, to be my wedded wife, to have and to hold from this day on, in sickness and in health, till death parts us. Okay, Vicki, it's your turn. I, Vicki, take you, Steve, to be my wedded husband. To have and to hold from this day on in sickness and in health till death parts us. As a token of your unconditional love, you have chosen to exchange rings. The ring is an unending circle which symbolizes your unending and undying love for one another. It has no beginning and has no end. The circle keeps going. So with that being said, do we have the rings? And I know we do, but I just have the question typed in there. Steve, if you'll place Vicky's ring on her finger and repeat after me. Get on there. With this ring, I offer you my undying love and my unending devotion. From this day on, I pledge my faithfulness to you. Vicky, if you'll place Steve's ring on his finger. And I usually tell them the whole hand, but I wouldn't say that, but I thought it was. But, uh, but y'all figured it out. So Vicky with, said, with this ring, I offer you my undying love and my unending devotion. From this day on, I pledge my faithfulness to you. Let's pray one more time. Father God, I thank you, Lord, that we can celebrate Steve and Vicky coming together. Everything that they are as individuals come together today as one two families come together as one with you in the center of everything we do and the foundation of their life and their marriage together and god i thank you that we could celebrate here today with friends and family that witnessed this event and it's not really about today we're just this is just a kickstart of, of a lifelong 
journey that we all get to be a part of and celebrate together. And we just give you praise and we pray for, for just years of a blessed marriage. And we give you praise in Jesus' name. Amen. Well, by the laws of the state of Texas and before God and everybody here, I now declare that you are a man and wife. You may kiss your bride. Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Woo! Right. Woo! Oh my gosh. <laughs> if you can do what they did in that movie.